we are interested in how emotions, how thoughts, how experiences in our brain eventually affect our health. All emotions, all thoughts eventually activate specific brain regions. Now with the new technologies, we can actually monitor and activate these specific brain regions and monitor the effects on the immune system. By understanding how the brain controls the immune system, we can start asking ourselves and utilize this potential embedded in the brain to cure. Understanding the physiological mechanisms, this is our goal eventually to uncover the mechanism whereby the brain controls our physical well-being. Placebo is a wonderful example for the changes of how emotions, how one's thought can affect physiology. Because people receive sugar pill and they get better. And we have no idea how it happens. We don't understand the mechanisms. Our recent research proposes one such mechanism. A patient that received placebo treatment has this expectation, positive expectation to get better. And we know that positive expectations are located in the reward system in the brain. So there is a specific brain region which is activated in positive expectations. So what we show is that activation of the reward system can change the activity of the immune system and the ability to fight bacteria. So this is for us was a manifestation of the connection between the brain and the immune system. We will be able to manipulate the brain and to manipulate the potential embedded in the brain to cure by activating the reward system and potentially also many other systems. In our research, we monitored how activation of the reward system affects immunity. And to do that, we collaborated with Shai Shanor, a professor here in the department. We activated the reward system and monitored the effects on the immune system. This way, we could now show that activation of the reward system boosts antibacterial immune response. We can now develop new ways, new therapeutic targets to manipulate the brain in order to activate the immune system. For example, there are new ways like transcranial magnetic stimulations that can target specific brain region activity. There are now companies that develop video games with the idea that they will be able to activate specific brain regions and this may be a way to activate the brain in order to control the immune system. The Technion being uh, one of the few technological institutes that have also a medical school offers this unique opportunity to harness the technological uh, capabilities along with uh, medical developments. And on the other hand, we have here a direct access to the hospital. So we have access to patients and we have this opportunity to combine all worlds of the technological capabilities of the Technion along with the medical uh, capabilities of the hospital around us. And most importantly is the students, the medical students that are actively involved in the research uh, going on in the department. Department. There is a huge potential embedded in ourselves, we just need to understand it in order to harness it.